on music and DVDs. My thoughts are all scattered on this one. We'll see how this goes. <laughs> okay, are we filming already? Yeah. Oh, have you just kept it while I was changing? No. Hi, this is Joel with Story Pipe News, DVD and CD releases for the week. Uh, three DVDs and three CDs. Number three for DVDs. The Hills Have Eyes. After, I'm just gonna read this review from Rotten Tomatoes because this is great. Now remember The Hills Have Eyes is about a family in the desert. Nuclear testing is a remake. I think it was a Wes Craven film initially. Murderous strangeness. Okay, here we go. After being led into the sandy middle of nowhere by an arrogant but ill-prepared conservative, a Democrat pushed to the edge savagely skewers a desert terrorist during a skirmish in a village inhabited by the victims of an American military operation. I think that about sums it up. Number two, Night Watch. This is a Russian film. No one saw it, neither did I. Except for fanboys, the fanboys who, who are always like skirm skirmishing around the internet going, oh, this great new Russian film's coming. It's part one of a trilogy, a horror trilogy. I guess part three is gonna be in English. I, I don't know, it looks kinda cool. You can check it out, but remember, when fanboys love something, mm, that's kind of a bad sign. Number one, Syriana. I wanted to see this and then, you know, it turned out to be about oil and I was like, where's the talking lion? CDs! Number three, Under the Iron Sea by Keen. In their own words, in making this record, we try to confront all our worst fears. That's really funny since their previous album was called Hopes and Fears. When do you think you want to go after your worst fears on, on the previous album? And I listened to some songs by them and they sound a lot like Travis. In fact, I'd heard them by mistake in a restaurant and going, did Travis come out with a new song? So I'm thinking maybe Keen's worst fear is that uh, they sound like Travis. Number two, I'm going to tell you a secret. Soundtrack, Madonna, as Amazon says, with a staggering 35 number one dance hits during her unparalleled career, Madonna is the queen of the dance floor with an unrivaled reputation for astonishing stage spectacles. I'm going to tell you a secret reveals all. At this point in Madonna's career, having come out uh, crucified, uh, like a virgin, uh, you know, all the, all the, the big cone uh, bra, all the things that she's done, I, I'm really thinking that there is no secret that she's going to reveal that's going to shock me. Anything short of her saying I'm a man is, is just, it's just not going to work. Number one is Luce Nelly Furtado. Okay, I, the new hit song, I, let me gather my thoughts on this one because the new hit song for Nelly Furtado is Promiscuous. Now this is a woman whose previous hit song was I'm a Bird, so I guess her follow up to that is I'm a Slut. Okay, are we filming already? Yeah. Oh, you, have you just kept it while I was changing? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Do people know that we filmed this all at once and I just changed my shirt? Do you know that we do this because uh, if I don't change my shirt, you think, why is he filming every single day in the same shirt? So I changed my shirt so you think it's different days. Does it help? Are you oriented now?